against the Anastasia machine. This is the on off key from back side. This is the air, nitrous and O2 hose pipe. This is the on off switch. Then this is O2. These two are for nitrous and this is for air. This is O2 pressure gauge. This is nitrous and this is for air. These two, this is for O2 cylinder and this is for nitrous cylinder. This is airway pressure gauge. This is backward switch. Here it indicates it is in back mode and if in this side it is in vent mode. This is APL bulb that is adjustable pressure limiting bulb. Inspiratory and expiratory bulb. These are the bellows. This is the main indicator. Now on the machine. This is the alarm mute button. This is to end the case. These buttons are for operating this. From here you can increase or decrease this. One set. Okay. To change this. Okay. More settings. Increase, decrease, then acknowledge. One set. Close. So these buttons are to set these functions. This is the battery indicator. These are the readings from patient. This is which you set. This is the spirometry graph. This is to set the upper and lower limit of the alarms. One set. Close. And this is to change the modes. Ventilation modes. In this, these are the modes. Volume control mode. Pressure control mode, synchronized volume control, synchronized pressure control and pressure support ventilation mode. So if I want to activate pressure control, press OK. Turn the knob to change the setting. Set the value and then confirm. So to start the ventilation, set the pad vent switch to vent. To stop, pad vent switch to back, press this, turn knob to end case. This is the airway pressure graph and this will be flow graph. This is from patient side, this is peak peak value, peak mean pressure, minute volume, O2 percentage. Here is the lamp on off button. This is the O2 flush button. This is the ACOGO switch AC0. This is the soda line canister. How to uninstall this soda line canister? Pull this green notch and remove. Match this slot with this. Install 